Hey friends, what's up? Kaz here. Welcome back to another server amateur or bucket spigot plugin tutorial. If you're joining for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button because I do these every week. Well, it's been a little bit of a lull, but we're back at it. Really excited. And if you find this video helpful, please leave a like because that helps me out for helping you guys out. Let's get this going. This one was actually not requested. Um, I just came across it because it had fantastic ratings. So I'll talk a little bit about that at the end of the video. This is made by Master Cake 10. It does require a vault and economy and it's called Time is Money. Basically, it's a way that your players can accumulate money just for being on the server. Now, it if they go AFK, it actually disables. You can turn that off if you want. I don't know why you'd want to, but it gives them an incentive to be on the server. Let's talk about commands right away. You can see Tim is reload and that stands for time is money you can then uh do a atm username now this is an admin function to pop pop up an atm otherwise your users can use the sign if they have the correct permissions let's talk about permissions real quick before we get into it showcasing the plugin you got tim.reload tim.admin that allows them to do that atm command and then you have tim.atm.place in order to place an atm sign and then tim.atm.use in order to use these atm signs so in order to make an atm sign super easy you can just you put bracket atm and then you could put put stuff here and then it makes an ATM. So what this does is players can right click on it, they can check their ATM balance in here, they can withdraw money from here and they can deposit it in there as well. So it's not on them at all times, it's actually there, which is pretty, pretty neat. So I have it set really crazy high here because I just wanna showcase what's going on here. You have two spots where it says how much you've earned and then the time frame that it's set to. So I've only got it set to 30 seconds and it's 100 because I have the VIP permission node. You could do this permission node. You could do this by chance too. So every five minutes they have a chance to make money or whatever. So that's kind of cool. And then you can also run a custom command in addition to giving the players money. So not only have I got money, but I also got a diamond. Now, one side note, I have it set up where it's actually gonna deposit that money directly into the bank rather than into my balance, uh, which is really neat. And that's all stuff that you can configure. Let's take a look at the configuration and check it out. So, okay, so here we see our server. So we're gonna jump into the plugins folder here and then we popped our time is money. There you can see we have vault and it's all up to date. And then we're running essentials, which is the economy that we're using. And then we go into time is money and we wanna open up the config file. All right, so here we are in the config. It's pretty straightforward and self-explanatory. This plugin is not overly complicated. So you can turn on the AFK payout if you want. You can have it display in chat or display in action bar. I have it enabled for both. So you can choose one of those as well and then this is how long it will show up in the action bar that's 10 seconds that's that spot right above the e or your xp bar um so we want to give money every 30 seconds just for tutorial purposes that's what i did i think by default it's every 10 minutes and then i changed this to true so instead of giving the money directly to the player it puts it in their bank and then they have to go to the atm to pull it out now you can turn on choose payout by chance by heading setting that to true so it will be delivered by chance instead of permission. So I'm not sure if you can do both of these. We have it done by permission on here, but your chance, I'm guessing that's gonna be 10% there. And then you have a max payout per day, which I'm probably getting pretty close to in this tutorial. And then the payout amount for the default, and then there's no permission node because it's the default one. And then uh, permission node, tim.vip, which I did have. And then you can see that it runs that custom command, which is, really cool you can set up whatever command and then this i always love it when authors do this so you can really customize what it is that is said so you probably want to modify this stuff so it makes sense if you change the time frames all that stuff and then you have other kinds of names so if you want to change it to be your own 
language, you can do that in there. Now, this group ATMs is pretty cool. So maybe you have your economy separated between different worlds. You can actually group your ATMs so that they only work in that world for each other. So it totally separates out your ATM balances. So you set that to true and then you set up your groups so that um, people in one world can't access their money in the other world, all that kind of. Like I said, real straightforward. Let's jump back in the game and wrap it all up. So hopefully you found that video helpful. Like I said, this is a really kind of neat and simple plugin. I love these that are out there. The ATM command actually opens it up for the player. So if you run that slash ATM against another player's username, it opens up that GUI for them not that you can see what's in their ATM, which is kind of nice. So hopefully you guys found that video helpful. Please leave a like, let me know what you guys think. This is Kaz, reminding you guys all, enjoy the game.